What's up guys, Nathan here, and today we're going to be playing some Feed and Grow Fish. Now, if you don't know what this game is all about, it's basically like a Gario in 3D mode, except you're in the ocean eating fish. Uh, hence the title and the picture here, which is really cool. I like it. Um, so, I'm going to be going through these three maps here, and I'm going to be going through all the modes, and I'm just going to be playing on the first fish, and just kind of showcasing, and I'll maybe fight like the Great White Shark when we get to the ocean level. But let's start off with the river level. Uh, once again, this is just going to be a little showcase of the maps and the modes. And uh, whichever map we like most, we might do a series on if you guys want to. So let's get right into it. We're going to do the river first. So this is the fish selection for the river. Uh, so we have catfish for the strongest fish here. Um, we have piranha. We have salmon. We have pike. We have bone rex. And I like the bone rex the most. I think it looks cool. But uh, the catfish is somehow the strongest. Didn't think cat. Oh yeah, catfish had teeth. Never mind. Okay, so we're just gonna go jump in as the piranha. Um, so there's an ability in the ocean they have for the bibus. I'll show you guys later. Bibos, however you want to say it. Basically a group thing. And uh, don't you think piranha should have a group ability? I think so. But let's go in. And uh, another thing um, I don't think really makes tons of sense is the respawn timer. I don't know why they have it. I, I think you should just be able to respawn whenever you want. And we're getting dragged by the current. <laughs> Alright, let's go for one of these guys. Come here, come here. Come on. Okay. Get him. Get him. Okay, there. Alright, we have him. Our butt buddies go after him too. Let's try to eat. Never mind, or you can take it all. Okay, let's try to get away from these guys, maybe. Oh, bone rex. Uh uh, run, run, run. Oh gosh. Was that a salmon that just jumped? No, it's one of those things. Okay. <clears throat> Voice crack. Alright, so we have these blue guppy looking things. Let's go for one of them, maybe. They look pretty easy. Oh, shoot. A pike. Run. Let's go for this sponge looking thing. Okay. So we're doing around 0 0.7 damage per hit. Never mind. Oh, no. We're falling off the waterfall. Oh, no. Okay, so it looks like we're in um, a little lake type thing. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so we have a bone rex here. All right, I think I showcased the map enough. There's like this cool shield and stuff here. Uh, you can't really do much with these. You might be able to hide in here from like a huge catfish. You might be able to hide in here, but I don't think so. Like I said, let's go for the bone rex just to finish this off. Come on. I just want to try to kill it for the memes. No, wrong fish, wrong fish. This one, come here. And we just got swallowed. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Alright, let's go showcase the next map now. Alright, next map is the swamp. Let's go ahead and jump in and see what we can be. Okay, so for the swamp, we can be the uber. <laughs> uber. Okay, we can be the raptor fish, we can be the diava, we can be the... Kledge of a Kledge. I don't know how you say that. Catfish again. Snakehead and Swamp Turtle. Uh, I've played at this I <laughs> I've played at the Swamp Turtle before and it sucked. For some reason I couldn't surface fast at all and it was really strange. I didn't really like it. Uh, the snakehead's my favorite on this map. So let's go ahead and jump into the Hmm, we can play as these two. We should go for the raptor. I kind of want to showcase the call of gang ability. All right, so we have a gang right here. Let's turn that on with E. Let's go f try to hunt something now. I think we should go for these guys maybe here. They look pretty weak. It's like they one-shot me. That'd be funny. There, now we can collect the meat. I don't want... Because if I bite it, then they're going to try to steal it. Look. Never mind. They were going after that one. Okay. Chew them up. Yes, all right, free meat. Let's try to level up a bit. I, what I've noticed with the recent updates on this is you can't um, grow a fish that huge anymore. Oh no, oh, that was one of our buddies, I think, that got ripped apart by that snake head. Oh God, okay, let's go. Let's try to get out of here, maybe. Ooh, look at this, a little worm. Come on, let's see if we can swallow it. Okay, we swallowed it. Like, he was five XP only. I thought it was gonna give us like 10. There's a diabo, let's go for that, why not? That was a bad idea, I think. 
but it's not doing that much damage. Surprised that you'd think that the fish that's up here would do a lot more damage. It might make up for it in health, though. Okay, can we kill this thing? Come on. Oh, my buddy's coming in. Yes! Alright, we killed it, I think. I think it's dead. Come on, is it dead? No, it's alive. How is it alive? Oh, and I got wrecked. Okay, so I found a turtle and we just got swallowed. Well, you guys got to see the turtle <laughs> until I got swallowed. I didn't even get to show uh, what it's like when you bite it and stuff, but whatever, it doesn't really matter. Let's go on to the ocean map. Okay, so the final map, the ocean map. Let's go ahead and play in that real quick. Show you guys the fish and show you guys the great white shark, which is uh, an achievement if you kill it. So I'm gonna, I haven't killed it yet, surprisingly, but I've played this game for about seven hours already. But, you know, it's pretty hard. <laughs> You'll see why in a minute. All right, so we can be the Bibos for free, or we could go in as the Teotaka for five, because we have six. But I think we're going to go as the Bibos, because we have the Call of Gang. So let's go in as that. Also, I apologize if you can hear my chair squeak, I'll show you. If you hear that once in a while, it's because of my chair. I don't know why it does that, but uh, I'm going to get a new chair soon, so don't worry. Uh, let's go for these little guppy things. Let's go for them. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Wait, did I even enable the gang? Shoot. Okay, there. Gang's on now. Come on. Yes. No. Dang it. How are, how are these guys so hard to catch? Okay, so it looks like we already tagged one, so everyone's gonna go after it now. Alright, and it got wrecked. Yeah, oh, oh, okay, that's really violent. <laughs> okay, uh, looks like there's like the, a tuna looking thing over there. It ate one of our buddies. No! Die! Die, you monster! Yes! No! Oh, I wanna get out of here. Oh, why are you like that? Oh, it looks like they killed it. Nice. But I don't know why they're just standing there. They're still alive. Otherwise, we would have been able to eat them. Look. Just sitting there. That one opened its eyes. This one did, too. How did that one get so big? So you can get a little bit bigger, but you can't get as big as you used to get, which is kind of sad. I wish you could get bigger. And there is the second biggest and second most expensive fish there. That is the Brewrag, Browrag, I think that's how you say it. And it's attacking pufferfish. Oh no. We're probably going to be on the menu next. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Alright, so where's the... Alright, so this is the great white shark here. This is the boss. This is the strong one here that I can't really beat. And uh, if I spawned in as a bigger fish, you'll see why it does. I'll show you at actually the end of this. Um, what's it called? The end of the map showcase. I'll show you how much damage and health it has. But let's go for it right now. Come on. Let's see what we can do. Besides get swallowed. Maybe we can kill it. Because it's not really fighting back. Why not? So if we just latch on and keep doing this, we might be able to kill it, actually. Rip. Okay, so that was the three maps. Now we're going to try survival mode. And then finally, we're going to do my favorite mode, Crab Madness. And you'll see why. So let's go ahead and go on the great map. I don't know why it's called that. It's pretty lame. Okay, so survival is probably my least favorite mode. Uh, just for the fact that there's only four fish to choose from no matter how many coins you have. And uh, it's only, and it only goes up to the Bivos, which is kind of sad. But uh, we're going to go in as the free fish, the butterfly fish. And there's Mosasaurs on this map, I forgot to say. And it's pretty cool. Um, I've never killed one. I don't, think, I don't think I'll ever be able to kill one like that. But uh, yeah. Oh gosh. Do we? Are we in? Okay, we're, we're in. Alright, let's go for 
something small. Let's not get swallowed whole. Oh no! Are you kidding? Oh my god. Oh! Alright, here's a jellyfish. Let's go for that, maybe. Can we bite it? Yes, okay, we can bite it. And the jellyfish don't fight back, as you can see. Even if you go to the tentacles. Alright, so I guess we can swallow this. Let's try to bite this, maybe. Come on. We'll break it one day. Can we swallow this? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought we had to break it up. But uh, I guess we're that small. Level 15 is the cap, so I'm gonna try to get to that, maybe. Let's go for higher ground. Uh, my friend told me that all the um, all the goodies are at higher grounds, like all the starfish and stuff that don't fight back. So let's go up there. Uh, I think the only thing that could kill me up there is crabs, actually. So let's go for this. And this is an example, this weird sponge urchin thing. Let's go for it. Try to kill it. Come on. One day. One day. All right. Perfect. Go ahead and eat that. We got about six XP for each. Let's go for this thing next. And we're level two. Nice. All right, so I'm just going to keep eating away at these things, and I'll be back in a moment. Okay, guys, so it looks like our fish is starting to starve to death. We need to kill this thing fast, or we're going to die. Look, it's red now. It's red. We're going to start losing health in a second here. Come on. Die, 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 die. Okay. All right, let's eat. Okay, our hunger's back up. Phew, that was close. Okay, so we've made it to a, uh, I guess, adulthood, I guess you could say. Uh, we look, we're looking normal now and not like some guppy. So, yeah, it's great. Uh, we got this look at level 3, which is really low level. I'm surprised. I thought it was like level 10 or something. Oh, oh, there's a Mosasaur. Did you guys see that? Oh, shoot. Guys, look, it's right there. Did you guys see that? Look. Oh, it's so cool. Yeah, this guy is definitely the king of the sea. Not that great white shark puny thing. Wow, it's so cool. Look, that's a tiger shark in comparison. Wow, this thing is huge. Wow. And the cool thing is, there's um, a ton of Mosasaur skulls around here. Look, check out that. It's cool. That guy's definitely the king of the ocean, not the gray white shark. He probably eats them for breakfast. Holy crap. I don't know if I can find him again, but yeah, there he is. And uh, this part of the map is in development, by the way. The developers are working on it, as you can see. You can't pass this. Yeah, but there's a ruined temple-looking thing over there. We'll explore that maybe in another future episode when it's finished. If I even continue this series, it's up to you guys. All right, so I'm going to show you Crab Madness now. I'm just going to get swallowed by him for the memes. But uh, yeah, I'm going to run out of hunger anyways. Come on. Come on, swallow me, swallow me. Or are you too fast? He'll just get killed by a tiger shark, whatever. Same thing, right? <laughs> I'll be there in a few years, never mind. Alright, so Crab Madness is on the ocean map, because, you know, 90% of crabs live in the ocean, but yeah, whatever, it's, it's makes sense. Alright, so we can play as the normal crab here, the pirate crab, I haven't unlocked this yet, I don't know how to get the pirate coins. But uh, we can play as the King Crab for 10, which basically... <clears throat> but we can play as the... <clears throat> so the crabs for this are the Normal Crab, which does 4 damage, 17 health. Uh, the rest of the stuff no one cares about. Uh, we have, for the Pirate Crab, 17 health, 2 damage. But I think this guy can collect the coins for this. And has a different ability. Passive... <laughs> Passive alcoholism. <laughs> Whatever, okay. Uh, and the king crab has the passive green crab leader, which all of his minions will follow him. And uh, we have the active crab spawn. Once you hit E and you have 25 XP, you get um, minion crabs. So let's go ahead and play as the king crab. Looks like we have some starfish off the bat. Let's go ahead and kill these guys. Come on, okay. Let's eat it up. Alright, so we have a dead fish here that my minions just ate because they're pigs. Let's go for the, uh, what's it called? Let's go for another fish and see if we can drag him down to our minion pile. Come on. Come on. Alright, we got him. So basically, if you hold these guys down enough and you have an army of these crabs, they'll basically, like, over, like, what's the word? 
they will swarm the, the fish and then he'll have no chance. These guys can literally defeat sharks. I wish the great white shark would come lower because I'm pretty sure if you had a big enough army you could kill the great white shark. Let's go ahead and spawn some guys in. Alright, so that's a pretty good starting army. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. Just no, stay away from the eggs, stay away from the eggs. And the uh, really annoying part I think that these crabs do is they'll attack the eggs if you attack them, which is really stupid in my opinion. I don't know why they have that in. Let's go for this guy. Yeah, he's dead. So, yeah, here's our minions. They're spawning in. Perfect. Let's go ahead now and hunt something bigger because we have minions now. There's an eel. Yes, let's kill this thing. See, look what I mean. They swarmed the, the, the eels. But it doesn't matter what it is. So you will swarm them. They'll know. They won't know what to do because it's stupid AI. Well, AI can't really be stupid, but it's AI, so uh, it will just get totally bugged out, and then it won't do anything, and then you basically kill it. All right. So for the last part of this video, I'm just gonna spawn in all of the crabs I can. And uh, sadly, when you spawn in crabs, it de-levels you. I thought it would just like go down to the nearest level, and then you'd have to get more XP. But you know, it kind of makes sense, because if you're a crab and you're trying to spawn in things, it would kind of be annoying if you could only spawn in a few at a time. So that kind of makes sense, actually. But uh, let's go ahead and spawn in these minions right over here. This looks like a good spot. As many as we can. And then we're gonna go for a shark, and then we'll end the video. All right, so all of our crabs are starting to hatch. And uh, look how many you get in like a short amount of time, it's insane. Look at this. I'm just having an army. I've gotten an army about five times this size, which is really cool. Uh, I think recently they made it so they're, I don't know if it's recently or from the beginning, but they made it so you can only have 40 crabs, but uh, this looks like about, I'm not gonna count, but it's like about 20-ish. 20 20-ish crabs, something like that. But uh, let's go for a shark now. I want to see how efficiently these guys can kill them. All right, so there's a shark right there, a hammerhead. Let's go for it. Come on, I know you want to go for me. Oh my gosh. What is that up there? I think it's huge. Whoa, oh, I didn't even notice. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, we don't have our full army. That could be bad. That could be bad. It's already killed like two. Come on. I'm spamming the clicks here. Come on. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, I think it's already dead. It's dead. It's dead. <laughs> okay, but I think that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like down below. It really helps you out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys all next time. Oh, and before I end the video, don't forget to turn on post notifications. Because uh, sometimes people miss my videos for some reason. I don't know why YouTube does that. It's probably a glitch. But make sure to put on the post notifications by clicking the bell down below. And uh, anyways, I'll see you guys all next time. Peace.